hi guys and welcome back so i went to targets today and bought up some stuff i intentionally was going to um i had to take ashton my son to the doctor he had to have his nine year wellness check and we did that and then of course he wants me to take him to targets because he did a great job getting a shot right Mhm. Mm but he did cry a little bit but I still took him because he's been doing really well in school and I'm just taking up for himself um, in school um, and doing what he had to do and just staying on his routine, which I need to do him a new routine for the week. But anyways, um, we stopped at Tarjay. Ashton, let me tell you what he got because he was all on my bill, <laughs> even though he had like $30 of his own money. Um he still y'all know our kids will be on our bill okay whatever they want will be on our bill so um on sunday is national grandparents day if you didn't know um sunday will be national grandparents day so ashton was so sweet um he bought my mom his nana um a thing of flowers at targets and he bought her a card and then he bought himself like some Legos. And he, he was really, really, really like just his mind was open to purchasing and learning how to put the card inside of the credit card thing. And then also we used cash because he had to use cash because he had $30. So I was teaching him everything about the value of money. So he's been very interested in that. My son is nine years old in the fourth grade. So I just love the fact that he is open minded and very responsible to be a nine year old. Um, so yeah, we got, he got that, he bought those things. And then, so he, on my ticket, he put a Thomas train, which was like $24. <laughs> and then he had like a, a big plushy dinosaur, uh, Minecraft, um, dinosaur looking thing. Um, and which that was $34. Um, so yes, my son was living on. And so all this right here, plus those two things came out to $106. His bill was only 35 or 20 25 or 35 dollars so all this plus his two items were um my on my total was 106 and you don't see what he got but i just told you um he only spent like 25 35 dollars which was okay because that's all he really had in his wallet like i'm teaching him to be responsible with carrying a wallet as well but he still is not too responsible when it comes to that because he feels like he's going to basically lose his wallet and if he loses money then he's going to cry and we ain't got time for that um so anyways um what i got from tarjay and i've been just waiting for this cup and waiting and waiting and waiting for this coffee cup to come because they're always sold out i finally got me a coffee cup i run on coffee and country music i love me some country music too y'all didn't know that now y'all know um I love me some R&B too, but I love me some country because girl, like sis, like bruh, like it's just something about country music, Kang Brown, oh my gosh. <laughs> yes, <laughs> you heard it first from It's Andrea and Michelle, sis, Kang Brown fan, okay? But anyways, I bought this cup right here. Oh, and um, what's his name? Um... His name is Jimmy something, um, but he's a black country singer, and he, oh my gosh, he sings country like, oh my gosh, his his singing is really, really good. Um, but I recently got this one from Target's, I know you guys probably seen this a lot, Southern Gal, I got that one, but I got that like, like I think a month or two ago, but um, I was on a search for this one, and I'm so happy that I found it. Um, I always like little country, you know, I always tell, like, I always tell everybody, I'm, I'm a southern girl at heart, just living in the city, like, if I could live in a country, and just, you know, girl, like, sis, like, bro, like, that's more breathing for me, breathing room for me, I get to be next to nature, like, period like next year i'm gonna go to tennessee where my friend stays my best best friend she's like my sister well she is my sister and i'm gonna go down there and check out apartments check out jobs because i just feel like that's where i need to be like i 
I'm sick of being in the city. Like, I want to be somewhere. And she stays, like, out in the country. But I do want to stay close to the city. <laughs> but uh, my mom's from Alabama. And she, she's even thinking about, like, just going back just to visit and see what this all about. And stuff like that. Like I say, if my mom leave Texas, I'm leaving too. I'm not staying here. Um, so, I did buy some birthday um, cards for my boyfriend's niece. I bought her two cards. This one and this one is for me. I thought that was really, really cute. And then I bought this one from him. Um, we got to get some gift cards. She's turning 15. So... We know when they get in their teens, they only want gift cards, money, or like electronic items. Now, we're not that rich, and we're not even rich because we work in a nine to fives. <laughs> but we do save our money. But we're going to just give her gift cards. I'm going to get a gift card, um, a Burlington gift card, and Babe's probably going to give her money because he always gives her money. She's very spoiled. And she's like the next best thing to his daughter um, because they um, just all grew up together, him and his sister, his niece. So he pretty much raised his niece, um, just her best, best uncle, like her best uncle. <laughs> so just like my uncle, I took he took on a role as being like our best, best uncle. We wouldn't call him dad, but... We will always feel like the cousins in my family, we will always feel like, oh, that's dad. But we know that wasn't dad. We know, duh, that's our uncle. But he just was always there. So that's how my baby is. He's always there for his knees. Anything happens to his knees, boy, I'm telling you, he's going to go haywire. Um, so I found her that. Also, you guys, I'm very excited to show you guys. I found my cup. I found my aesthetic cup that I wanted. And I'm seeing you guys always drinking out these cups. Guess what? I found it for three dollars in the three dollar and up um, section at Target. I'm so excited. They only had this one left, so I definitely got it. And probably gonna be looking for some more. Um, <coughs> excuse me, you guys. Then I um, was looking at who I was looking at on McKenna Walker on YouTube. Um, I just love how she do all her aesthetics in her house. Her whole house is like aesthetics. She dressed, you know, in neutral colors. And it's just calming, you know. And um, she her, she does her family like that too as well. They all dress in like calming colors. Her house is calm, neutral. Everything about her is aesthetics. And so, I'm not trying to be aesthetic, like, deeply into it but some of the stuff that she does like as far as her organization and I just like her her video her um her filming all over around um as far as like um aesthetic wise I love like how she just does everything um so I seen her haul these once before and she said she got them at Target's I will I got them at Tar mine's at Target's I got two for twenty dollars so they were ten dollars a piece honestly I thought they were five but that is okay I'm gonna look for like two more because I need two more in the fridge so what I'm gonna do is put water in one uh milk in one um juice in one and I'll probably put milk, two milks in one water, one juice. Um, because I just think that having all that plastic in the fridge and um, it just caused so much like confusion. So just think you have these, just four of those in the fridge besides all this. Like it's a lot of stuff. So what I'm going to do, yeah, yeah. I just thought about it because I do have like creamer in there too as well. So I'll do one creamer for my coffee in the morning then one for water one for milk and then one for um juice so i'll know whenever like i go to the store how much juice how much milk that i need to grab to fill up these and then also i don't need to be buying like i have like all these random creamers like that i really wanted um and this is the pecan 
the pumpkin pecan at the front and then the southern pecan at the back those are my favorite and then back there i think it's like vanilla and cinnamon which i haven't tried yet um and i could just make vanilla and cinnamon myself but yeah so let's go into the bag let's go into the bag i found some new can to um hair products now i have used these already and um i honestly love them i don't know if it's just because they had a new bottle or what but it just seems like they're different um so i have the cantu conditioner and then i have the cantu cleanse which is just a shampoo um and these are sulfate free cleansing cream shampoo sulfate free hydrating cream conditioner um and yeah it does say i didn't even see that new look but i'm gonna go back to grab some of the uh, I think it's the foam where I can wrap my hair because you guys I am no longer um, natural I just got my hair texturized and all that stuff like literally just got it texturized and so I need to get some products to put on my hair my hair um, she also said that I can still twist my hair you know if I want to um, and it'll still twist and all that good stuff so i was just super tired of my natural hair you guys and yeah and she didn't hide anything she was like you might have some you know some breakage because your hair is so used to being natural um so don't freak out about that and i'm not freaking out because hair grows back you cut it it grows back you you permit you st your natural still is going to grow grow right back in like I'm not worried about it. I was never stuck on my hair. Just always like if I want to cut it, I'll cut it. If I want to get a you know a texturizer, I'll get a texturizer. Basically a perm. Um, if I want to grow my hair out and wear it natural, I can always do that, like I did. Um, and it doesn't take my hair long enough, long to grow. Um, and it just grows right back. Like my son, he got his hair cut. His hair is already grown back. You know, so I just know that. Um, with this, I'll just have to do um, more work because I don't want it to, like, break off, break off or, you know, like that. I don't care about the shedding part because that's going to automatically happen. But anyways, let's get back to this. We got some Listerine Cool Mint. This is Babe's favorite, so I got him some. I was trying to find the bigger bottle at Target's, but they didn't have any. Um, and then um, I got some Sensitive Skin Wipes from Target. These are the up and up brands. They smell really good. They're not like too, um, too fragrancy. They don't even really have fragrance in them. So you can use them. Like I use it for that time of the month. So I like to stock up. And I've already used one. <laughs> but I like to stock up on those and keep them in the house. So um, even if Ashton like uses them, I'm fine with it. So basically this side right here is just going to be like hygiene you know hair and stuff like that just picking up some stuff um i got babe some of the dove men care sport care power renew two in one exfoliating body face scrub um i got him that and then I got him some Dove deodorant. I couldn't find that one in Target's, but I just got him the one that we know that he loves, which is the Dove Men Care Extra Fresh 48 Hour um, Protection Plus Comfort. This is real good for like if they're out doing something all day. Um, it keeps them fresh, and they don't have to keep like putting on deodorant or getting funky, musty, or whatever. Um, so. That's why I like to buy him that 20, like 48 hour protection. Then I got him more of the Method Men body wash. This is the Sea Surf one. Um, and when I bought it, I didn't realize that it was already open. So I think it's right here. And most of the time, like it's up here. But I'm not going to take it back because it was open. I'm just going to wipe it and then let Babe um, use it. Um, for myself you guys I did get some Nair body cream hair removal 
um, rich cocoa butter and vitamin E to skin, smooth skin for days, reduces hair regrowth, dermatologically tested. I always try to get stuff that says dermatology tested because um, I don't want to put anything on my body that um, the dermatologist didn't test, especially like stuff like this. And then also this is not tested on animals, so I'm really excited about that because you guys know I'm trying to stop using stuff that is or have animal products in it or been tested on animals I'm sorry guys um, and that one the hair product is actually animal um, none tested as well and so I cannot wait to use this I'm probably gonna do a review on it see how I like it mostly I did this because I wanted to do like a quick um, of a JJ hair removal and I found out that shaving down there uh, caused like um, bacteria and it also um, what is this said I was researching some things and it was like um, it sometimes like shaving down there would cause a lot of bacteria and then you can catch like different things down there and then if you don't shave properly the hair won't grow in right correctly so I um, wanted to go ahead and try this now I'm not gonna say I'm completely not gonna shave because I don't know how this is gonna do but if it does me good then this is what I'm gonna be buying this is like $9.99 you guys like 10 bucks but the bottle I mean it's a nine out so I mean it speaks for itself but this is called Nair, Nair um, and I will be doing a, um, a review on it with one of my daily vlogs um, and so yeah daily vlogs I can't wait to start I can't wait to start for real and I don't think I'm gonna be doing like during a weekend but just during the week I guess um, and then I also bought these up and up floss picks um, with built-in toothpicks let's see okay so that's what it looks like and then that's the toothpick you just pull it out yourself I guess but this is in the flavor of mint flavor and there's a 90 count in there um, it says it's compared to Plackers micro mint flossers so I've never seen those but um, I bought these because I, I like those and also they really do get like all that nasty stuff out of your mouth like they really do um what else we have here okay so the next couple of things i always be in search for because they are so cheap and they are 99 cents and i love that i can just grab some for three dollars and change and especially when i have rewards on my targets app and they're, they'll be free um sometimes they'll be free or i have to pay like change um but I bought some more toothbrushes and I think they're way better than the dollar 25 tree to be honest with you guys so if y'all see these and uh, targets definitely pick them up the new find that I found so I already have some of these but I just want to stay stocked up these are the pink ones and these are the soft toothbrushes these are smile worthy and they're the brand smartly I believe and you get two toothbrushes for 99 cents you know so you're basically paying 99 cents for one and you're getting the second one for free that's a huge deal if you didn't know and I did have these two as well these are the till ones so basically I got I paid for three two brushes and I actually got three for free and then also I got these these are the new colors this is the gray and white and I'm in love I, I'm gonna actually gonna go back and get some more of these because I love these um, and so I got three of those two brushes there um, the last two things that I got were um, and this is on clearance and I should have got another one um, but I didn't see it but this is the eco the uh, EOS evolution of smooth um, and this is the fixer medicated lip ointment um, and it says it heals and repairs you guys they were on sale 
was $3.99, but they put them for $2.79. That's a clearance to me. Um, but it has natural Shia in it. And again, um, it's just a really, really, really cool product to have for your lips. If you're trying to repair your lips and stuff like that, it's really cool. And also, it is not tested on animals. Well, not tested on animals. So, really cool that I found that on clearance. Um, the last thing that I got myself is this um, Instant Lift Brow Pencil in Abram. Um, I wanted to get my my eyebrows a little bit more tint. My eyebrows are already brown, but I just want to get them a little bit more tint. And I need to learn how to do my eyebrows, you guys. This is um, the product of Elf. If you know Elf, um, Elf is not tested on animals either. Um, so I was looking for a lot of Elf products, and I found some. So I'm gonna go back, and it's cheap. Elf is cheap, real cheap, but it's good quality makeup. Um, so I'm going to start uh, venturing out into Elf. And I've seen some like lip glosses and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, I got this. And then also, I'll probably grab another one. Because I have like, you know, grays in my hair. And I, I'm so sick of like dyeing my hair all the time. Like, that's been a big problem for me too, is just dyeing my hair all the time. And so I'm going to go get another one of those and just start, um, start like temporarily and it's not a dye or anything, but I'm just going to temporarily, temporarily pencil it in my, uh, all my grays and just hide my grays like that, uh, for throughout the day. And then when I wash my hair, I can just wash it out. Um, because I just think that that's a great idea if, um, instead of just dyeing your hair all the time. Um, you can have like a little temporary pencil on you or something like that in your purse or something and um, just excuse yourself, go to the ladies bathroom and color your hair <laughs> temporarily. Um, so that is it you guys. That is all I got. Um, plus these cards here. I know. 106. <laughs> And you looking like, girl, what did you buy from 106? Yep, 106. <laughs> but anyways, um, thanks for watching um, the channel today. And um, don't forget to comment below, you guys. And I'll definitely see you in the next video. So, new schedule, Monday through Friday. Because I'm going to try to start doing a daily vlog. Um, I've been putting out, like making a lot of filming a lot of videos so that I can keep up and I can edit um, edit each night and put a video up the next morning um, and then so the weekends I will not be filming because that's gonna be my family time but I'm gonna always have something for you during the week and you wondering how long I'm gonna do this I'm gonna try to stay consistent like for a week or two and see how it goes if I like it I'll continue um, if it's too much for me I know how to stop you guys so anyways I'll see you guys later bye